One day, as Sophia was exploring the royal gardens, she stumbled upon a mysterious portal hidden behind a cascade of colorful flowers. Curiosity sparked in her eyes as she approached the magical gateway. Before she could comprehend what was happening, the portal sucked her in, transporting her to a realm beyond her wildest dreams. As Sophia found herself in a new and unfamiliar land, she discovered she was not alone. Standing beside her was Jenna Ortega, a talented young actress known for her roles in various films and TV shows. Sophia's eyes widened with amazement as she recognized Jenna and realized they were about to embark on a magical journey together. The duo found themselves in a place called Simple Words for Kids, a world where language and imagination intertwined to create extraordinary adventures. The landscape was a vibrant palette of colors, and the air was filled with the giggles and laughter of animated characters. It was a place where words came to life, and every story was an opportunity for learning and fun. Sophia and Jenna were greeted by a friendly talking book named Lexicon, who explained that they were chosen to explore the wonders of simple words for kids and bring the magic of storytelling to life. Lexicon handed them a magical quill and a parchment that would allow them to shape their own stories and influence the world around them. The first challenge that awaited Sophia and Jenna was to help the alphabet fairies, who were in distress. The fairies had lost their letters, and chaos had erupted in the once harmonious land. Without the letters, words were jumbled, and stories became nonsensical. It was up to Sophia and Jenna to restore order and bring back the missing letters. Armed with the magical quill, Sophia and Jenna embarked on a quest to find the scattered letters. Along the way, they encountered talking animals, friendly trolls, and mischievous elves. Each creature they met had a piece of the puzzle, and with Sophia's ability to communicate with animals, they swiftly gathered the necessary information to solve the mystery. As they ventured deeper into simple words for kids, the challenges became more intricate. They faced riddles from the wise word sphinx, crossed the grammar bridge guarded by the punctuation pixies, and even outwitted the synonym serpent in the thesaurus forest. The magical quill glowed brighter with each success, and the parchment filled with tales of their exploits. In their journey, Sophia and Jenna learned valuable lessons about teamwork, creativity, and the power of words. They discovered that even the smallest word could have a significant impact, and that every story, no matter how simple, held the potential to inspire and educate. The climax of their adventure led them to the heart of Simple Words for Kids, where the alphabet fairies awaited the return of their lost letters. With a flourish of the magical quill, Sophia and Jenna restored the alphabet, and the once chaotic land transformed into a harmonious symphony of words and stories. As a token of gratitude, the alphabet fairies gifted Sophia and Jenna a special book that could transport them back to Enchantia whenever they desired. With heartfelt goodbyes, the two friends bid farewell to the enchanted realm of simple words for kids, carrying the lessons and memories of their magical journey. Back in Enchantia, Sophia shared the incredible tale with her fellow princesses and the citizens of the kingdom. The magical quill and parchment remained as a reminder of the extraordinary adventure that had shaped their understanding of the power of words. And so, in the kingdom of Enchantia, where fairy tales and adventures were a part of everyday life, Princess Sophia and her friend Jenna Ortega continued to explore the wonders of language and imagination, knowing that their magical journey in simple words for kids had only just begun.